Get it. The Bird Show. All right, so we're about to start texting tutor for Stephanie here. Stephanie is the mother of the bride, and they have a friend that is kind of being really rude here, right, uh, Kristen? Very rude. Super rude in that... Um, she's asking for two invites to the wedding other than her. So it would be a plus three. (laughs) Unbelievable. (laughs) Unbelievable. And we have to tell her, no, no guests for you. And what's the reason for that, Kristen? No guests? Uh, Because the venue can't accommodate it. Like, they just don't have enough room. And then if she does it, Stephanie, the mother of the bride, is worried that this is going to be a domino effect. And then it's just going to be a free-for-all. And everybody's going to be bringing just a crap ton of guests. And that's going to be a lot of money. Yeah. All right, Stephanie. So before we get into texting your daughter's friend, um, how much interaction do you have with this friend normally? Like, is a text like this going to come out of nowhere? Do you, are you familiar with who she is? Is she familiar with you? Do you guys have an established relationship? I've known her for many, many years because she was my daughter's friend since, since high school. So um, it's not like we're close or that we're in contact all the time. But yeah, but we have each other's numbers. And if, if there's some, yeah, uh, like for Christmas, like sometimes we text because she was coming to her home. So, no, it's not going to be, like, out of the blue, but, it, but it's not that bad we are, like, in contact okay. all the time. Either. All right. So, I mean, there's a really good chance here, if she's known you most of her life, mm-hmm. that when you make this request out of respect, she'll say, I understand, and this will be the shortest texting tutor that we ever have. I've crafted it. I'm ready. You're ready? Okay. Already. Oh, yes. wow. This and I, should I be think easy. it's good. Yeah. All right. So, you ready, Stephanie? <sighs> I am. Okay. <laughs> Put, hey, Nina, period. Okay. So, hey, Nina. Mm-hmm. We, unfortunately, mm-hmm. can't accommodate your request to bring any guests. Any guests? Uh-huh. Plural, to the wedding. Mm-hmm. The venue isn't large enough. The venue isn't large enough. Okay. So, only you can attend. So only you can attend. Okay. Thanks for understanding. And then you're going to end with love you and can't wait to see you. Love you. Oh, that's a good one. Love you. (laughs) (laughs) Wait to see you. All right. So, Stephanie, read the whole thing back to us. Mm -hmm. Um, Hey, Nina. We unfortunately can't accommodate your request to bring any guests to the wedding. The venue isn't large enough, so only you can attend. Thanks for understanding. I love you and can't wait to see you. Perfect. Yeah, that's perfect. We yes. all, well, all, you different when you get a pen in your head. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I crafted that thing. Right? Yeah, that was impressive. All right, we're I, all I endorsing like you. this one. I've taken a liking to Stephanie, and I really want <laughs> yep. this to go well. I feel very protective. Yeah. All right, Stephanie, you can go ahead and hit send on that. All right, you hit it. Okay, send. All right, Stephanie. And we're going to be firm, Stephanie. We're yeah. going to be kind but firm. These are our boundaries here, and there's nothing wrong with having boundaries, and we're not going to let somebody take advantage of those boundaries. Of course, and and yes, I mean, I don't know if those friends, you know, they they might be drunkies or that, you know, <laughs> mm-hmm. looking something, looking a spectacle. I, I know, I don't, I don't like that. Exactly. Right. You don't want any drunkies there. No. <laughs> No, I wish I had you handling my guest list because <laughs> I had quite a few. Yeah. yeah. Yep. One who took a bottle of bourbon from the bar. <laughs> wow. Yes. That wasn't me, right? No, it wasn't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> there were literally people walking out yeah. with bottles from the bar. That's great. And I'm like, y'all realize that we are paying for that, There's right? so much booze there. I don't it even was, know why you need so to bring booze. the bottle. Okay. Um, Stephanie, I'm a little sidetracked here because and as we wait for the text to come in and then you tell us. I have a gift. It's a natural gift. Oh, oh. Uh, it's actually a superpower. As I have traveled the world, I can hear an accent. And within 10 seconds of hearing that accent, I can tell exactly what country you are from. It's a oh, my God. All right. Okay. All right. So I have identified your accent. One of two different countries. Is it either Mexico or Colombia? Oh, my God. <laughs> um... Puerto Rico, but yes, Caribbean. Wait, don't tell me. Don't tell me. Oh. Is it Puerto Rico? Wow, really? <laughs> Is it Puerto Rico? 
Puerto Rico, yes. Oh, yeah. It's amazing, baby. It yeah. is. It yeah. is a gift. Woo! Man, he's, I mean, you got to give it to him. And fuego. That's why he's in the Georgia Radio Hall of Fame. There it is. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wait. I just got a text. Oh, my God. Okay. 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 Um, you, you read it to us, Steph. Yeah, we're waiting on you. <laughs> it says, hi, I don't really have a choice. I R S. VP for all of us because I have them here from out of town and it would be rude to be gone all day at a wedding. Stephanie, we're going to take a deep breath, all right? This is not going to be easy. I think we just got to like really be firm and say, I'm sorry, that's not a possibility Mm -hmm. because the size of the venue, that's not an option. (sighs) You can RSVP somebody's wedding without telling them? What she did is... You get the invitation, and it'll say on the envelope, you plus a guest, or it'll just have you. And then inside, it'll have the RSVP card, and you just circle yes or no if you're attending. Sometimes Mm -hmm. people like to go rogue and write things on the RSVP card. (laughs) Like, oh, yeah, (laughs) me and Jake and Phil and Stu are all showing up to the wedding also. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Okay. (laughs) All right, so say Uh, I'm... I don't know what to say. Okay, no. Yeah, we got you. You're going to say... I'm sorry. That's not possible. That's not possible. Okay. What else do you need to add to that? We're not going to apologize. I mean, okay. she's the one that's being rude, so. We want you there, but we cannot accommodate your guest. Boom. <sighs> All right. Just want to send uh, that one. That's it. We good there? Yeah, go ahead and send that one, and she'll have some kind of. All right, go. Guys, I don't know if you guys ever planned a wedding, but this is so stressful. It is. Yep. I don't, I don't think I don't think I've slept in like the last month. Man, um, did you send that out, Stephanie? I did. All right. You yeah. seem you seem very sweet. So I'm I'm just asking this um, as we're trying to form our next text. Are you capable of saying, "Don't make me come over there and beat your ass"? <laughs> <laughs> she just has to type it. She have to say. It. Can you, t- can you type that? I mean, you can start formulating it right now. Uh, Mama Stephanie's about to come over there and beat your ass. <laughs> uh, uh, no, but I, I appreciate your help, guys. Mm-hmm. I don't, no, you're doing good. You're doing great. Did we say we loved her in the first text and yeah, she didn't did. say it back? Yep. Okay. I thought that was what happened. Yeah. Rude. Yeah. See, mm-hmm. I don't like that. Yeah, let, let's see. Let's see. Oh, wait. just got the text. Yeah. Um... <clears throat> Surely two additional people won't be the reason okay. it's too crowded. Mm-hmm. I can't come if I don't bring them. It would be rude of me to leave them home while gone all day. Okay. okay he, 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 hold on. B, that's not my problem. No, be like, mm-hmm. it's also rude to bring two uninvited guests to a wedding. They can't come. It's also rude to bring two uninvited guests to the wedding. They can't come. Um, just go ahead and send what you got, Stephanie. I, so let me ask you another question, Stephanie, as you send that. On a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being super duper important, like a must, how important is it for your daughter to have this guest at the wedding? I would say plus 10. 10. Like they, mm. they are, yeah, okay. they are like sisters. All right. So I am feeling here that she's probably going to threaten to not go to the wedding. So are you prepared to say that's your choice? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. I have a feeling that's the way we're going here. I mean, I, I, ha- I have to. I yeah. have to. This I mean, is not, this oh, is not on you. Yeah. Text. <laughs> this, actually, this actually isn't your choice. This is going to be her choice. Yeah. If, if she's not mm-hmm. showing up to the wedding, you can't feel bad that she made that choice. This is not about you. Uh, this mm-hmm. is about her. So don't feel bad about that. Yeah. Okay. Um, she says, well, I know several of her friends who are bringing guests to the wedding. It's rude to allow them to bring a guest and not me. Wow. Was going- Do you know who she's okay, referring to? She's just manipulating now. Huh? It's like manipulating now. Oh, she's manipulating now? Yeah, she says, I know mm-hmm. several of her friends who are bringing guests to the wedding. It's true to allow them to bring a guest and not me. She's trying to rationalize the behavior. She's hoping you're going to say yes, but you simply can't accommodate it. So I think, mm-hmm. again, you just have to reiterate, like, I'm sorry that's not possible. You can't bring a guest. So I think re- 
reiterate it. Mm-hmm. I am sorry. I'm that's sorry. not. I'm sorry. That's not possible. You can't bring a guest. Yeah, just repeat that. Don't Very. even engage in the who gets to bring people. True, true, because that's going to be like a back and forth. Yeah, exactly. 100%. We're not going to engage in that. Should she say something definitive like... And, and, and I'm not going to argue fine. about this anymore. Yeah, I can't argue about this anymore. Then that's it. Yep. I'm sorry, that's not possible. You can't bring a guest. I'm not going to argue about this anymore. We okay with that? Okay. I'm good with it. All right. Let me send it. Send okay. it on out. She's being yes. so rude. I mean... For her to try to turn this around on you, and then you have to, like, somehow define who's going, who's not going, and explain any of that. No. This is not... It's none of her business. Nina's day. This is your daughter's day, and she's being super rude. And at this point, I got to be honest with you, I think she's being very disrespectful to you. Mm-hmm. That's your friend's mom. Mm-hmm. Who would think you'd have some grace? Dude, I'm backing out immediately. If I that's mean, what she's mom's called wants, her, I'm done. 100%. She's called her rude twice. Yes. I, I, I just got a text. So she sent a thumbs up. Okay. That's it? That's probably right. her way of saying F you. It is. All right. So a thumbs up in this case is got it, yep. but not accepting it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but it's more like uh, she understands. You're not going to argue about it. Gave you a thumbs up. I She hears you. Who knows where this is going to go? All right. Stephanie, <laughs> when she shows up with her two out-of-town guests... Are you prepared mm-hmm. to not allow them in? I mean, there's there's somebody check the guest list, okay. so I'm, I'm I'm going to I'm going to leave them up to them. If they're not okay. on the list, they they cannot come in. All right, good your, for your you. Job is done then. I'm proud of you. I would offer my services, but I'm like 5'4", 140, and no one's going to, like, stop for me. So if I'm oh free that day, yeah, mom, 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 you want to take up. care of that? <laughs> I'll give you some, some excitement in my life. My guess here, Stephanie, is now Nina is probably going to go right to your daughter, is my guess. So when we talk to you next week, I'm sure there'll be some drama going on right there. But inevitably, this is probably going to have to be your daughter stepping up and going, yeah, that's what, what, what mom says is absolutely right. Sorry. You know, but so, I I guarantee you she's gonna show up with the guest. You think? Yes. Yeah, I think so. After think that so. interaction and how rude she was, rude. She's she, extremely entitled. Mm-hmm. She's gonna be there. All right, Stephanie. That's the best we could do today. So I think uh, my guess is she's probably already texting your daughter. And if that's the case, you, your work is done here. But I would really love to follow up with you. Great Don't night. blame yourself. Yeah. It's not on you. Nope. Thank you, guys. Thank you. All right, Stephanie. Uh, we'll catch up with you next week or the week after, okay? Sounds good. All right, bye-bye. All right. Bye. Get it. The Bird Show.